Hey everybody, I'm Richard. And I'm Caitlin. And we are the Game Test Dummies, and welcome back to 60 Seconds. Um, not Papers, Please. <laughs> Jeez, was that embarrassing saying that <laughs> last time. Okay, let's just grab stuff, Water. grab stuff, grab stuff. Boo! Uh, radio! Can I, can I hold that radio? Yes, I can. Oh, that's the checkers board? <laughs> Where's the freaking shelter? It's this way. Just throw it! You gotta go. You gotta, gotta move radio. on. Radio! Where Turn. is it? I'm gas getting the gas mask, mask in the map. Where's the radio in there? Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay, radio. It's important. Why is it so sketchy? I don't know. I think it's just the uh, sensitivity on the mouse. Get out of the way! I gotta get some kids and some people. I want the daughter for sure, so I gotta hurry. Go, go, go. There's the daughter. Move. Come here. Go. We got 15 seconds. I can get my wife. Where is she? Throw! What are you doing? Where is she? Right in, in there. there, in there. I see her. Oh no! And a flashlight. Grab it! Run, you freaking bastard. Run! Yes! I don't think I got very much food, did I? No. I got the whole family, though. Here we are! I'm not playing with the controller this time, so you don't have to watch this thing slowly go across the screen <laughs> like last time. Um, I don't know how many episodes we're going to do on this series either. I'm just planning on, if I beat it, then we're probably not going to come back to it. So we're just going to keep trying. And if we fail in this episode, I might just try survival mode. I don't know. Let's see. Yada yada, first day, nothing happens. No one gets nothing. I got three cans of food and two waters. It's not bad. Yeah, it is. Could have been worse. Last time we got one food and one water and we made it to like day 50 something. Just need to send people out. Yeah, uh, Mary Jane's fine. Timmy's Ugh. good. Dolores, Ted, you're all ugly. I'm so cold. Of course you are. I don't know if I should skip the first trip because it's highly radioactive. Yeah, I'm gonna do that just because someone's gonna get sick and I didn't get the first aid kit. Can't sleep? Too bad. I don't have the first aid kit. We're gonna do it this time. Uh, Jeez, they look all exhausted. <laughs> That's not good. Ignoring our symptoms, we tried to get at least an hour or two of sleep. No luck. Mary Jane has to drink. Mary Jane's so does Timmy. thirsty. Timmy's thirsty. 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 Well, guess what? You gotta go one more day. Highly reactive trips to the surface are a big risk to our health right now. And we're not gonna go yet. It's so very serious. Someone is very serious about banging on the hatch. We are scared to open it, but it might be some good news, right? We would gladly welcome any friendly faces. We would welcome any friendly face. Uh, that, that, that makes sense. Uh, our neighbor Ned. We're pretty sure that there was, if there was any reason why our good town would get bombed, he would be that reason. Shall we open? Of course. Sure. Why would Ned, our He's neighbor, gonna take your radio? Get, it would be Ned Flanders. God, why am I turning into a Simpson? It's Ned Flanders. What happened? Opening the hatch was a bit risky. It seems to have given us an awful sickness. That coughing is driving us crazy. Did we get anything? Who the hell was banging? Was it the sickness banging? It's a freaking <laughs> disease knocking drink, on the door. Ah, uh, fine. Fine, you can all have water, I guess. Jeez, it's a whole bottle, though. Gone. Oh, you greedy. Greedy bastards. No, no one's going outside yet. Yes, let's listen to the radio. Maybe it'll say it's safe to go outside. Jeez, is Ted ever turning into a Simpsons character? It looks like you. I'm not yellow. It's a very black hair, Richard. How fortunate. You said that last time. How fortunate we took the radio with us. Listen to it. They still play music out there, don't they? Mary Jane's fine. Timmy's fine. Dolores is fine. Ted's still sick. Well, Ted can get over it. Looks like the area is still radiated. Going to the wasteland right now is unsafe unless you don't mind getting sick. I do mind. Trying to play it safe and smart this time, because last time it was just, yes, let's go out every time, let's do everything, let's... I'm probably still going to say yes to everything. <laughs> Take care of yourself, someone will come to rescue. Fine, fine, fine. Fine. You're all good. Good, good. Trips to the surface are a big hiss risk to our health. Everything is shaking, oh my god. Wait. What? If I pack to go to the surface and then save. Why did you just say that? Because we're gonna lose two things. We gotta save something. Everything's shaking. Obviously, we're gonna save the radio. I'm hoping packing to go to the surface will save the gas mask, but I doubt it. 
I'm just hoping they'll pack the gas mask. Why was everything shaking? I have no idea. No flashlight and the gas mask are broken. It was an earthquake. Earthquake or not, nothing is going to stand between us and our daily dose of radio static. We How the heck does that get ruined? I don't know. The earthquake came in and grabbed it and wrecked it. It was very upset. Almost as upset as I am. It will all not last long without water. That's great. Well, you better last one more day because we have no water. Who's going outside? Let's go, Timmy, you little freaking bastard. You better not die. Can you say that word anymore? What? You say that a lot. What? That word. What word? You know what word. I have no idea what you're talking about. Whatever. Rude. Timmy's good. Oh, I should have given him water before he went. Oh, well. Water, water, water. Fine, you can all have water, but you better hope your damn son brings back some. Because if he doesn't, guess what? Okay, let's listen to the radio. Is it going to be cards again? Because we don't have any damn cards. Hope it's not cards. We knew that the government has not fallen. They're coming to save us. Yay! Mary Jane's hungry. Okay, well, you're all hungry and not thirsty. I guess that's a good thing. Eat, Dolores. You little, oh no, that's Mary Jane. Whatever. Yeah, get it right. Don't tell me what to do. Why is that one broken? They're glass bottles. They're safe, Mary Jane. They're all fine. You're all fine. Well, this is great. Mary Jane has been dropping a hint that it's a special day for her today. We had to think <laughs> about it hard, and after eliminating your average festivities, the anniversary of that great barbecue we had three years ago, and International Popcorn Day, we realized she was talking about her birthday. How did she forget her birthday? <laughs> this means we need to get her a gift. Well, we don't have a gift. Why would we give her roach spray? <laughs> Happy birthday. You get to kill them all. Oh, she's crazy. Mary Jane is too old for birthdays, that's what we think. No, it's not, we just didn't have anything. The wasteland's full of surprises like this man on the other side of the door knocking and claiming, okay, last time I gave him the checkers board instead of the ammo, he laughed and took it, so no, we're not giving him anything. Oh, he's back, did he bring water? He did not, he brought freaking spray. Why, where were you that, oh, cards. Where were you with that damn spray when it was your sister's birthday? Bastard. That word. I know. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, he brought one food. Not very useful. Oh, he did bring a water. Nice. I guess he did get lots of stuff. Good boy. Timmy's hungry, and he doesn't feel well. Dolores is not eating for a while, and she wants water. Ted's hungry and water. Jeez. Needy. He's hungry. What else was it? Mary Jane's thirsty. Dolores, then these guys are both hungry and thirsty. Yes. Jeez. Never gonna make it. Let's pack to go up again. Need to send people out, because we need supplies. You're a supply wagon. Rude. Damn, is she ever crazy. <laughs> Our daughter, the bird lady. Nothing better than the quiet after a storm, or was it the other way around? Mary Jane's hungry. I just gave you water! No, I didn't. You're fine, you're fine. So hungry and thirsty, the kids. Jeez. Well, we're boned. Who's going outside? Mama, get out there. You know what's best. Mom always knows what's best. Right, Caitlin? Um, I guess. Like, yeah. I guess, like, yeah. Like, totally. <laughs> uh, nothing. Timmy's sick. Surface. They're good. Everyone's good. We better be, because we don't have much to give you. Let's listen to the radio. Maybe they'll ask about the cards, and then we can put that outside. I hope so. I hope there's not like a flood the day before, and we have to choose between our radio and cards. So, uh, weak signal. Guess what? Great news. Follow the side's mostly gone. That's good, because we just sent Mama up there. Spare some water for Mary Jane. Timmy should eat. No, you guys all have to wait. We don't have enough water for two people. Today, an army broadcast interrupted uh, let us know any time. Anyway, they seem very eager to evacuate us away from here. But they went out several. Th they went over several things they needed to happen before they do it. The first item on the list is up to us. We need. To, we were given geographical coordinates, and need to get there and leave a sign we're still alive. Well, 
Okay, we have a map. That's a good thing. Good thing I grabbed that map. That's good different. Good thing. I thought it was like really repetitive, but that, that's different. And our map didn't rip somehow. That's good. Quick glance at the map gave us all the information required. We left a message in a bottle. Nice. Good thinking. We didn't lose anything. Oh, wait. What do they need? Everyone has to drink. Timmy's hungry. Mary Jane's thirsty. Timmy's hungry and thirsty. Ted's thirsty. Well, Ted gets the water. Because if he dies, every, everyone dies. <laughs> and I guess we can give you both food. There, there's technically fluid in that soup. Timmy got back from the shelter. His expedition looked fine. It turned out he was hurt on the hand. Rusted metal. The wound was infected. Let's cut it off. We don't have a first aid kit. I'm assuming the axe means cut it off, right? He is injured, it looks like. Oh, what? How'd we break the axe? Timmy was very brave about the idea of cleaning his wound with a heated axe blade. Okay, we weren't cutting it off. <laughs> the axe is in no shape. How hot did you make it that it's no longer in shape to use? <laughs> Mary Jane's thirsty. Too bad we're out of water. Timmy prefers apple juice. Timmy got hurt. Ted's hungry. Here you go, Ted. Here's some food. Bear hope Mama comes back. Both the kids are about to die. Please come back. Why Please didn't come you back. Because it's boring. Well, we lost one. That's great. I really wanted to make her a mutant. Uh, Mary Jean found out that she's not getting a single drop of water. She got furious and stormed out. Well, that's great. Barely sleep after all that arguing. Timmy wants a drink. Ted's not complaining much. Well, uh, lucky you, Ted. Your kids are dying of dehydration, but you have nothing to complain about. You're just yellow. Come on, where's mom? Oh, great. That one's gone. <laughs> oh, well, who needs kids? Lack of water drove Timmy insane. He opened the shelter door and ran away without looking back. He's not likely to return. It's not worth even touching it if we don't know what we're doing. Ted needs water to survive. Well, we don't have water, Ted. Oh, oh, oh. Should I give up the checkerboard for one water? Sure. I might have to. What do we need the damn checkerboard for? I better not need it. Yeah, then watch next yeah. time you'll need it. The army. Please put out a checkerboard. Yeah. What the? Well, he's bad shit crazy. Oh, she brought something. Okay, we got that water. Dolores came back. She brought two foods and one water. Ted's crazy. Ted the wants same water. Thing said about those bottles of booze lying next to them. What? What? Go same. back to the page. At one point, no one even tried to open them. No one even tried to open them all, but they opened the booze. Dolores has not eaten for a while, and okay, hungry and thirsty. I could do that. Uh, she does not notice that the kids are gone yet. I think she's too tired. I shouldn't care. Well, we need to send someone else out, and it's gonna be you, crazy ass Ted. Things are not going well. Where's the army broadcast about the cards or something? It's not gonna happen this time, is it? Dolores is hungry, and Ted's. Now it's the opposite. Good thing we have enough, and only two of us. Just the two of us. Go out, Ted. Leave Dolores all alone. Hopefully she doesn't die. Ow. So today, we were doing a craft at summer camp, and this little boy comes up and hugs one of the other leaders, and then all of a sudden he starts smacking her butt. <laughs> like, <laughs> she's like, don't hit my bum. <laughs> yeah. Okay then. Good talk. That was pretty random. The kid probably should have, uh... The, how old's the kid? Six. How old's the leader? In her 20s. She's probably just playing around then. Uh. Not yet. Anyway, that's today's radio news. Instead, they have been broadcasting requests for all citizens to assist in cutting down trees. We lost our axe for that kid that's not even here anymore. Bastard. No? What? Nothing. Oh my god, every day. Are you never fine? <sighs> There's nothing more annoying than silence, and that's all we're getting from our radio. No music, no talking, nothing. Is there anything we can do with the radio that'll make it work again? We sh sure no staring at it won't help. No, do not tamper with the damn radio. It's one thing I don't think I'll ever agree to. If you play with the radio, you're gonna break it. Look at her, she's like... <sighs> a zombie lady. 
We're sure they're experiencing technical issues. Yes, that's it. Everything will be just fine. Dolores would really love something to eat. It's every day. She has not, not been hungry or thirsty. Our gas mask is badly yeah. worn out. What? You get hungry every day. No, usually it lasts a couple days where we'll say they're fine. It's a game, Caitlin. I know. It's a good time to fix it. Well, guess what? We don't have that either. Ted should bring back everything. Come on. Where's Teddy Boy? Don't tell me he's not coming back. We really don't know how to repair it. It's probably best to leave it alone. Why? Wow, it's already broken. Dolores isn't doing very well. Her sanity is very questionable. Say she didn't need anything that day. Uh... Come on, I really want to win this one. I don't think you will. Still, it's better to be safe down here than dead up there. Dolores won't last long without water. Well, guess what? We're almost out of water. Where the hell's Ted? Great, we don't have either of those. What's that sound? Oh no, it's something or someone below us. Is it reasonable to go out and check? How about using that manhole in the corner? Is that the dog again? Too bad the earthquake shattered our flashlight. We couldn't hold the radio end of freaking flashlight. Ridiculous. Going into a tight dark tunnel is not a good idea, especially with those weird noises coming from it. They are giving us the creeps. It's just you, Dolores. Today was relatively calm for Dolores. We can't fix it, Dolores. Jeez. I'm sick of her shit. Where is Ted? He's never coming back, is he? Ted has been outside far too long, and he's still in return. We fear he isn't coming back. Great. What did Dolores want? She's fine. So Ted's not coming back. I can't send anyone out because she's alone. Should I just quit then? I can't win. Why? Well, if no photos, Dolores would really have something to eat. Because she, when she runs out of food and water, she's going to die. She died. I didn't feed her. Rude. Alright, well let's do uh, one more. We're gonna do one more try. Power run. I think okay. we can beat it. We'll be right back. Okay, Timmy's there. Gas mask, water, water. Daughter's there. What the hell is under your bed? I don't know, but I'm gonna grab it. Water, ooh, there's a radio right off the bat too. Okay, I'm going to grab her and the radio, and then I'm going to just panic from there. Can I carry the radio too? Okay. Go, go, go. Get out of my way, chair. Throw. Grab that water. Grab that water! What is under your bed is what I want to know. Oh, Scout's Handbook. Is that cards? That is cards. Go grab something useful. Is there food anywhere? There's food right there. Ooh, this room looks very useful. Go, go, go. Two! shelter go 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 sorry that it looks so sketchy when I look around in here grab that food and grab your wife happy wife happy life right where's the gas mask it's hanging on the wall I thought yeah grab him oh I still have room for one more thing food 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 of course I grabbed the farthest room away shotgun and flashlight Where's Shotgun, right around the corner. Ah, uh, flashlight. Where's Run. my? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Did I miss somebody? Ah, uh, no. You did not miss anyone. <sighs> Good thing too. All this made it in the shelter. Our shells. Okay, I only got you one. You got water. one water. That's not good. So, I got the shotgun this time, and the radio, and the gas mask. What did I forget? Keep wanting. I forgot the first aid kit, and I didn't get the axe either. Yeah, yeah. We don't have time to read all this. No one gets nothing. Second day. We're gonna go out right away, though. I don't care how sick you get. Favorite radio station stopped broadcasting. When we tried other frequencies, we found nothing but static. Are all the stations gone? Maybe we should tinker. No. Leave the freaking radio alone. Yeah, you hobos. Maybe I should say yes to that one time. No. Let's see what happens. Well, maybe it'll actually increase the frequency and it'll speed up the process. Water, 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 water. That's an entire bottle of water and we only have one. We have another day. I'm gonna give water to him because he's going out. No, wait. That's never affected anything before. I'm gonna give water to 
nobody until tomorrow, and you're still going out. <laughs> you can find water on the other side, right? Watch it say the end. <laughs> Everyone dehydrated. Everyone died from dehydration. Everyone dehydrated. Water, water, water. Here you go, don't tell your son. Why would you miss her? And then know. go back? Whoever designed this fallout shelter was a genius, but we can't really tell if it's green stuff dripping from the pipe is an included feature. We should probably try doing something about that. Okay, let's use the book. Probably shouldn't. Probably should save the book, but oh well. Better not be wrecked. Okay, it's fine. What does the book do? Ha! Problem solved. No leak, no mess. Back to our tidy little shelter. Nice, it worked. Fine, fine, fine. It's all good. Let's go. I feel it. This is the one, Caitlin. We're gonna win it. Timmy's gonna come back with everything. It's gonna bring an axe. It's gonna bring a whole jug of water. It's gonna bring oh, guns. I'm so uncomfortable. Why? I don't know. Everyone's fine. We're good. You're the one that wanted that chair because you said it would be comfortable. I miss the couch. I heard My you Oma's told- Yeah, you told your Oma. She said we can have that couch anytime. Like we oh. could have picked it up yesterday. Water, water, water. But we yeah. don't have a truck, so... We decided to peek outside for a minute. Oh, oh, growl. Yes, let's growl. flashlight. Growl. And then, growl. this time when he comes back, I'll make sure I actually have a can of food to give him. Oh, he's back, and he brought water. Holy crap, is he ever sick, though? Uh -huh. Ah, afraid for Timmy's back. Sweet, sweet prospect. Two foods. Two waters. He's sick. Oh, that's the last page. Sick, eat. Okay. Hungry, thirsty, hungry, thirsty, thirsty. Okay. So it was... I forget already. <laughs> Mary Jane is hungry, thirsty, then hungry, thirsty, thirsty. So hungry and thirsty. Holy, oh, we got lots of food. Hungry, thirsty, thirsty. That's all you're getting for a while, though, because we need to salvage, and we're going back out. What's that sound? Oh no, something or someone is below us. Let's check it this time. Last time we didn't have anything to check it. Maybe it was something good. Maybe it was a... Oh god. <laughs> what the hell was down there, Ted? What the hell? We barely made it alive. It was a giant mutated co crocodile. Or an alligator or something else with a giant mouth and plenty of teeth. Is anyone hurt? Great. Mary Jane's worried. Uh, Timmy prefers that. Timmy's thirsty. Dolores is fine. Ted's hungry. Frick, how did Ted- why did Ted get hurt? I should've just left it alone. So Timmy's thirsty and Ted's hungry. Alright, you can have water, I guess. But you don't get food. Who should go inside? Do I get food? Should I send Mama or Dada? Send the uh, Mom. Alright, we'll send the Mother. No one likes her anyways. Why? I don't know. It's rude. She's a very nice woman. That's my wife you're talking about, Caitlin. Exactly, that's why I don't like her. Uh, Mary Jane didn't cause any trouble. Despite the circumstances, all are going well. Dolores went to serve Ted's tummy is rumbling. We got lots of food, so you're lucky. I didn't even actually read if that thing was an actual dog. Timmy got back to the shelter and he's hurt. No, we don't have anything anyway, Timmy. And if we did, I would have said no, because we need the axe for trees. But we don't have it. That should have been the first thing I looked for. Uh, best medicine for any sickness or injury is to clean your teeth Clench. and ignore it. Clench your teeth and ignore it. That's what Grandma always said. She's dead now and has been for a while, ever since she got that nas nasty frog bite at the age of 25. Getting something to drink for Mary Jane sounds right. Timmy should eat. Ted's hungry. Where is water when Ted needs it? Did I just feed Ted? I don't know. Maybe I skipped it. So it's thirsty, hungry, hungry, thirsty. Thirsty, hungry. I can't give you water today, Ted. You can ask him tomorrow. As long as we have food and water, we can stay locked in, but we have. Yeah, let's listen to the radio. I don't know what happened with that dog. Obviously, the flashlight triggers the dog. When does he come back, though? Mom better come back. Good news the government says, so yeah, they're good. Yay. Who wouldn't fit in this car? Yeah, yeah. Water, water. Ted's infected with something, great. You guys can both have water. Oh, was it her or was it Timmy? It was Timmy. Are you sure? 
Yeah, you're right. Well, last time you said that and you were wrong in the last video. Oh, here it is. Yay. Here you go, dog. Why do we need it? I don't know. I think the dog's really helpful, but I'm not sure. I don't know if he actually comes in. He's not here, so I don't know. The dog was back for his former self under an hour. We don't know what they put in that soup, but man, that stuff is good. We decided the dog needed a name. The right name for him was Pancake. Come here, Pancake. Who's a good boy? Pancake stayed around for a while, but was gone the next morning. We can bet he will be back. Mary Jane's hungry. Timmy's blanket. He's shivering all the time. So Mary Jane's hungry. That's it. There you go. Oh, there you go. You gotta click it. About to go to sleep when I heard someone knocking. Who could it be at this hour? Who could it be at this part of the wasteland? How the hell did they survive the nuke? Should we open it? Yes, sir. It's gonna be a guy who gives us lots of presents. The end. <laughs> oh, is that more food? Yeah. Nice. Why didn't he give us more water? Turned out it was a nice, mysterious fellow in a weird suit. He gave us some soup cans. This will help us survive the next couple days. Mary Jane's thirsty. Timmy's sick. Ted keeps coughing. Time to ration supplies. Who was thirsty? Timmy? Mary Jane. Oh, Mary Jane wants something to drink. I guess you can have a drink, Mary Jane. Better hope Mom brings water. Ever since we jumped in our fall up shelter, we've been wondering about that other door in the shelter. Should it be... Should it even be here? Where does it lead? Last time I did this, I did the flashlight and we got a gun. So now that we have the gun, are we going to get bullets or is it going to be something bad? We're going to check it out with the flashlight. Anyway. Ow. What? My knee hurts. I don't know what happened. We inspected every corner of the room and found nothing. Well, that was a waste of time. So there would have been a gun if we didn't have it. Maybe I should have went in with the gun then. I was hoping it would get bullets. Mary Jane's fine. Timmy's thirsty, Ted's hungry and thirsty. Well, guess what? We don't have food, or we only have one drop of water left. We never thought we'd see a dancing cockroach. We still have him, but we saw that one was nearly as big as a cat. I'm not going to attack it because I want Mary Jane to be a mutant. Why? Because then you can send her out and she never gets sick. Oh. Oh, well, she's sick. Did, did we always have the gas mask? She brought water. Yeah, I was hoping did. she'd bring a first aid kit. Things huge, and there goes another one, which is everywhere. We're doomed. The looks came back. Two water. That was it. Damn it! What are you doing with your life, Dolores? So it's better when things are calm. Mary Jane's good. Timmy's hungry and thirsty. Dolores is hungry. Ted is thirsty. Hungry, thirsty. Oh my gosh! Hungry, thirsty. Okay. Uh, oh wait, I didn't give, oh I did. I thought I didn't give Dolores anything. And let's pack up to go out again. Uh, well, guess what, we don't have a checkers board at all this time, asshole. <sighs> anything new? Stranger was disappointed, but that was none of our business. Mary Jane's hungry, Mary Jane's thirsty. Sick, thirsty. Sick. So, Dolores is thirsty and Mary Jane is hungry and thirsty. <sighs> you guys are so needy. I don't know what to send out now. I want to send her out because she's could turn into send the mutant. Dolores. I don't want her to die. She's sick. And so is Timmy. <sighs> Fine, Dolores, you're going back out. Get a first aid kit. Probably shouldn't have sent her again. She'll come back with nothing. No news is good news. Timmy's fine. Dolores is fine. Ted's sick. The army on the radio again. Yay, and we have cards. Yes. Things are looking up. We're doing that right away, which means that we'll get to the next step faster. Last time we were on like day 50 when we put the cards out. Cards are in place. All we need to do is wait. Mary Jane's safe. Timmy doesn't need much. Moving. What? Watch by the cockroach. Oh, right in the corner. I don't know what you're talking about, Caitlin. Just wait for it. There's little white, yellow things that move. See? Those are dust particles, Caitlin. Yeah, that's you've, cool. You've never noticed those before? No. Ted is hungry. Ted needs water. Where is the water when Ted needs it? So water, hungry, and water. Well, no one gets anything today. Let's. Oh wait, we don't know what's happening. 
Yeah, let's listen to the radio. I was just making sure they weren't going to tinker with it. This music is great, though. Do you remember... Oh, yeah. It's random. It just popped in my mind. Do you remember light brights? Yes. Did you ever have a light bright I when did. you were younger? No, I didn't actually. I had those. Those are amazing. Yes, Does anyone out there I know what a light bright them. is? I, I, they were so much fun. You gotta Google it if you don't. Like they're like these. Oh, I gotta all, all after this. We're '90s babies. Yeah, Mary Jane's thirsty, hungry, thirsty, hungry, thirsty. Are they early, all hungry and thirsty? 90. No, she's just thirsty. They're two are hungry and thirsty. So thirsty. Right. Hungry. Good talk. So yeah, their light brights are like it's like this big box. And it lit up, and you can put pegs yeah, it in it. It has a light bulb inside of it, and then it has a black screen, and you put a thing on it, and you put the pegs in the holes to make the design, because you get these little pictures that had like an outline, and then you turn it on, and all the pegs were colored, so they'd like light up. Oh my god, those are so amazing. I don't know why I just thought of those. That was so random. Weirdo. We were barking, we were all at the door in a moment's notice this time. We were right, it was Pancake. He had come back, but it wasn't willing to enter. Instead, he seemed very anxious to lead us somewhere. Should we grab any gear before we head out? Map or gun? We don't have any bullets, so I'm going to go with map. Maybe gun. Go for the map. I just, like, what if he's leading us somewhere where it's dangerous? I don't know. Because we, we have a map, but he's leading us, so we shouldn't need the map. Did we get anything? We got more stew. Did we? We don't think the Lord's coming back. Told you I sent to center. Well prepared hiker always takes a map, that's what we always say. Trust the Atlas, we were able to look at the devastation of our town and get back home, or rather, Pancake takes long for a while, but he left before we got to the bunker. Before we got back, we were able to take a detour and get some cans locked in a car. Good thing we did some reading about the car mechanic in the scout handbook. Oh, nice. Mary Jane's diet could use food. Timmy's fine. Ted's fine. So Mary Jane's hungry. Damn it, we need water though. I'm gonna have to send someone else to the surface. I guess Mary Jane's gonna go. I was really hoping she'd become a mutant. Oh, and Timmy's gone. This isn't good. Timmy's very sick. Nothing we could have done. He left. Irresponsible parents. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mary Jane's fine. Ted's suffering from his injuries. We need a first aid kit. Who should go outside? I guess you, because we can't send Ted. Ted, don't die. Please don't die. This is our last attempt. I don't want you to die. Mary Jane went outside. Ted's stomach's rumbling, and he's thirsty. Well, that's fine. You're all alone. But you only have one drop of water left. We always wanted a pet, but we just couldn't decide what to get. A dog, a cat, no matter... We have a very own cockroach colony, unless we want to... S well, Mary Jane's gone, so I guess we'll get rid of him. Just so we don't get more sick. Oh, we died. Damn it! Oh, I didn't see that coming. No. Alright, well, we're gonna do, I think, one more episode on this game. Just because I feel like Caitlin and I both actually feel like it's getting repetitive. Um, anyone who's interested in this series, let us know if you want us to do the normal mode again or if you want us to do the survival one where you just start in the bunker with all this stuff. I might oh, do that. Really? Yeah, I might do that just so we can see the ending and beat it. We might fail still, <laughs> probably, you know what I mean. But um, if no one says anything, we're going to go with that game mode. If someone does want us to continue this that way, then we'll do it this way. So, yeah. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, press the like button, and we will see you next time. Bye! I was, I was like, I never put a name in. <laughs> Where do I get a hall pass from? No way. Okay, you can't go back in there. Can I get a hall pass from the teacher? Can I give it mums? No. How do I get a freaking hall pass then? You can't go buy him? Give him money.